Oh, help me. Hey, who did that? Don't squish them, though. I don't know what they're doing. Just a little ball, eh? Yeah, that looks like a ball. <laughs> Good morning. OJ and Raven here from Southern Manitoba. OJ and Raven. What about me? I did. <laughs> sure. Now we know who's more important, Raven. Superstar. <laughs> Good morning, OJ, Deb, and Raven. She's picking on me. On oh, a couple of dogs cross. And a couple of dogs cross the back there. lane. Though. That want to be in the video. Yeah. Always. So we first we're gonna start and then see right. that horn from the train and then while well, we waited for the train and then by the time we're ready to start then the dog started barking. they spotted us over here so we're uh, starting a new video off here and we're what are we doing today what are we doing today well this nice six by six that we're sitting on in the backyard here for the planter i've already marked it and, and you put a level uh, on i put a level on it so, Perfect. So you're saying I did a really good job she, here? A really good job. A really, really good job. A here. really good job. <laughs> Anyways, uh, yeah, so we're going to get started with this. And so we're going to cut it so I can do my ends, yeah. right? And I ordered some black dirt. Um, once harvest is done, then he's going to bring it over for me. A really good deal. Potato <laughs> dirt. And we might end up with some potatoes in our yard, but that's okay too. And uh, what else are we going to do? We're going to. Oh, and that black dirt isn't for these beds. No. That's for other for, places. For, well, along the side over here. Yeah. Well, maybe a little bit in the, but Maybe in the bottom, yeah. but I want better stuff. Yeah. More and for, uh, for what else are we doing? We're doing uh, maybe a little bit of plastic in the garage. In the she shed? In the she shed on the ceiling, get that all done. And this north wall, get it done. And then I can get the two sheets of plywood that are in my trailer there on the wall over here. And. Oh, there go the dogs again. Oh my. So we just better cut this short and get to cut work. Cut it short and get at it. And uh, you never know what we're going to do. So follow along. Let's go. Just like that. Just like that. That's that's a whole lot easier than using the you know, walkie cordless. <laughs> One. Ah, ah. It's a noisy day in the neighborhood. So that gives me one end filled in. The other end, that one will go in the bottom. And then we have to figure out what to do across the top. <laughs> Trains, dogs, all manner of noises. Yeah. Miss and Wawanee says peacefulness. So, we had to move to the front here because of the dogs barking. And then on the way here, another train went by. <laughs> but we wanted to show you the leaves, how green they are. There's a, a few yellow ones here and there, but yeah. We, uh, it's October 1st. October 1st, and the last couple days will be horrible windy. We're 
getting the effects of Hurricane Helene. And, Even uh, way up here in Manitoba? We think of all those people down there that lost everything. We're just losing a few leaves, so pray for them. And uh, yeah, we're going to get to work here, get some stuff done. And hopefully and, uh, uh, the neighborhood quiets quiet down, down a bit. But look up here. Yeah. If the leaves had started changing color already, like they Which normally they would be, are, yeah. um, they would have all blown away in this awful wind that we had. Yeah. But because they're still green, they're holding on good. There's a few branches. Time to get back to work. <laughs> beds put together <laughs> on this chilly windy day they'll be ready for spring huh. I got that on video Grub. Slug. 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 Okay, I get my pants is lined up for the pathways. So yeah, everything's got to be perfect. Thinking time. Yeah. Resting time, thinking time. Ready for you to cut. There we go. It's kind of like doing a jigsaw puzzle. It is. Just fitting pieces together, trimming them. Uh, and then I'm just trying to figure out over here how many... How much lumber I need, how much I have to do the big long planter on the end. looks wonderful so the first one will be about eight inches deep and the next what did you say the next one is 11. 11 inches and then about 12 inches But well, while I was taking this apart, banging and crashing, I had my head down. And I went over here. And I, with all these 6 by 6s here, I bought five 6 by 6s Two 10s and three 12s. And I bought absolutely everything that they had. And the three 12 footers are... Crooked as dog's hind, well, not quite as a, as a hind lane. A dog's hind leg? That's why you got a deal. That's why I got a deal. 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 I
I did lose one. Yeah. But mind. she had moved these there. Didn't even notice me. No, nope. she was just working away. <laughs> I just, I was working away. And Would you like to see how I do it? Well, I couldn't. If you want, I won't be able to do it now because I'm going to watch it and I'll injure myself. <gasps> See? That's how I did that's it. That's how she but did it. went way too far. Yeah. But. Well, that's what I had too far. Nope. See? She's a tough old girl, eh? She's like to let on that she's just wimbly. But, yeah. Yeah. I'll just kind of show you how crooked this thing is. So. <laughs> Yeah, it was, um, was sort of. There's a better side. It might be better. That might be the better side. No, I'm, that's worse. No. I mean, there's on a hill over there, but still. We'll figure it out. <laughs> Maybe. Something, something like that. Get this one You're getting a puzzle going here. And that one will be on the top. A little smaller, but okay. And then we piece one in there. Okay. Right, I gotta sit down. Huh. So the one that goes on top has to be set back, right? Yep. Okay. Thought so. I'll just get a piece to put in there. And figure out a piece for the end, and then we do the end pieces. I think that piece right at your feet is the one to use. Well, that's it for another day. Guess what? I never got to the she shed. So that's your problem. That's okay, we got my planters yep. pretty much done. You got your planters. This one wasn't even really started. No, it wasn't. We got that yes, one totally yes. done. And then it went got more six by sixes. And we also got the two by sixes for the each end. We got them all screwed in there and then the six by six we cut the end piece for there and then I also put big long are they that long screws in. how long are they they're 10 inches long to bolt them together bolt them together that's those ones over there my poor little impact was getting hot by the time I was done and your hands were kind of tingly yeah and then when I was sawzalling <laughs> it's just kind of the vibrating, it just the, feels like bubbles in your skin. Yeah. But so, the uh, the two by six one though, we're we're going to need to do a little bit. Maybe um, some stakes to reinforce in the middle, and probably line it with something just to give it a little bit more. I don't think it needs anything. I don't know, just because of the joints in the two by sixes. That's all yeah, I'm thinking of. Fine. Yeah, it'll be fine. That's what you say now. And there's my other ones that we'll finish tomorrow. Tomorrow's another day. Yeah. I gotta take a walk around now. And yeah, you take a walk. See, the, the grandkids have already been over. Oh, yes, they've been over. And, and Amelia said, can I, can I run in here? So. Round and round. Yep, she went around there. And it's going to be so much better in the summertime because there's going to be, uh, we're using the cattle panel. So there will be an archway there and another one here and another one here. So they will be able to run through the tunnel and they'll be able to run around the beds this way. And then he's thinking maybe we should put a fence across there 
where the neighbor's fence ends over towards the house. That way we don't have to worry about the grandkids escaping. Yeah. <laughs> she's a little escape artist, oh, yeah. so if we uh, blink and she's gone. <laughs> so maybe oh, if we had a getting pretty Yep, uh, he's running too. Going too, yeah. And then there's Raven. So maybe we just need a fenced yard all around. So maybe when we do the back fence back there, we'll do a side fence too. We'll see. We'll see. But it's time to quit for today. Yeah. It's a long day. Bye for now. See you in the morning. Bye bye. Good morning. Just another day in paradise here. So I'm just going to putt around. It's a windy, cool day. I think it's only supposed to be. 14 Celsius today and 2 tomorrow morning Ooh. which is probably about 34 35 Fahrenheit getting the yeah, it's in that frost range so yeah so we're gonna maybe put some plastic up here I've been tinkering around here and I have to put some studs in here to uh, Put the new door the old door that we took out of the the old kitchen because this little door here is you know it's not yeah. a very big opening there and then i'll have a proper door in here that actually stays closed yeah and not just blows with the wind <laughs> but uh yeah every time i try to clean one other spot i throw the stuff in here you can't see the mess behind her because Mm, I could turn but, around and show no, them, but no, I won't. That's fine. While you're doing that, yeah. I'm going to see if I can find a place to stack yeah. all the scrap boards yeah. out of the way around your saw, all the cutoff ends. Yeah. And also went around this morning and I measured all the rough openings for the windows. So if just I in case. find a find a deal, a deal, yeah, on a. Probably more likely a used window, but if I find some new ones at Home Hardware, well, I'm pretty sure that can something. wait till uh, next yeah, I can wait for another day. Another There's year? How about another, another year? year? Yeah, there could be I another got next year. Plexiglass on the on the outside, so they're they're good for now. So now we can plastic them from the inside. So let's go putter. You go putter. I'll go. You putter. I don't know what I'm gonna do. Putter putter. Okay. Yes, there's the train. Mm -hmm. Um, we still, we still had one part of the deck. I kind of put stuff there temporarily, but he's closing it in properly. So in the winter, no cats can come and visit. Isn't that a beautiful blue sky over there? Well, I thought you were going to see me. Well, you're pretty good looking too. So while he's doing that, I cleaned all the scrap. She's playing Tetris over there. Yes, yeah, so I'm just piling it all on a pallet over there so that next year if I have a boardwalk to make, then I'll have pieces of wood. But there's very little actually because he doesn't waste anything. And this is the stuff I'm down to. I've got a couple of tubs of scraps here, but they're all tiny. And this is what's left. So it should be all cleaned up pretty soon. So I guess he's going to take a break while I take my temporary blockade out of there. Oh, there's some more boards right there that I missed on the deck. Sure. And yes, we moved the barbecue up onto the deck. I think temporarily because I really don't want to shovel it around in the winter. Once we have everything cleaned up and hopefully some trees cut down, I want to put the barbecue over in this area out of the way. So it's starting to look a little re more ready for winter. I'm still hoping to get these trees taken out so that we can clean up that area, put the rest of the fence in there. All done? All done. Looks good, eh? Yep, looks good. No kitty cats getting in there. The next year we will have a step that goes all the way around.
So I don't know if we even said what we figure we'll do here. That could change, but. Oh, everything could change in a heartbeat. We plan to have deck across the front of the shed, not connect to the little deck there. Probably patio blocks, something leading across there. We'll have to level it all out, make sure water doesn't sit there. And wherever the deck ends, which is what, 10 feet out or something like that, we'll figure that out. Then we're hopefully just going to get some decent grass planted and growing in this area. So that way we have a place to sit outside. The barbecue will be over in this area, probably at the end of the deck there somewhere or over there. And then a nice grassy place for the grandkids to play. Yeah. <laughs> The important things, right? Yeah. Okay, I'll go back to my sorting of miscellaneous chunks of wood. It's break time again. We're just sitting here enjoying the beautiful weather. But I'm just watching the clouds go by. This is what you do when you're retired. You work a yeah. bit. You sit, sit a, bit. a bit. I wonder how long it's going to take for that cloud to reach the other one. See anything in them clouds? Look over here. These ones swirling around. It's so beautiful. Getting closer. And still, lots of green leaves. We need to go for a drive and find some color. Yeah. I have a feeling there's color out there somewhere. Somewhere. But the clouds have just about joined up. You just stapling the screen on. I'm hoping. To, oh, there go the dogs. I'm hoping to keep the foot long dewworm night crawlers from coming up and I'm, a, I'm also hoping to keep the slugs out but I think we're going to need to do more to keep the slugs out. Cutting another piece for that big one. I took the cut off edge from this one and along there so this is And we still have some left. And there they are. The screen is in. Might be a waste of time, not sure. Um, people might wonder why we're putting screen on the bottom and worried about roots and stuff, but pretty sure the roots can make their way through that. And most of them, planters, are deep enough that things like carrots and beets will be in that big one over there. Anything like flowers or things that don't have a deep root will be in the more shallow ones so I think they'll be fine I'm just hoping that the screen does what it's supposed to do next thing is to put cardboard down and then start layering other stuff and he didn't get to work in his shed much puttered a little bit uh, about five minutes and then you came back and helped me with the planters. Sure. That's why I didn't get anything done. Well, if you do anything more, you'll just I'll have to... The yeah, you'll have to show them tomorrow or sometime because okay. I think we're done for the day. Not very nice though. Actually, I think it's... not it's, bad, but it's not... It's breezy. And when the sun goes behind a cloud, it's chilly, but it's a perfect day to be doing all of this except I've got stuff all over to hold the screen down just so it doesn't blow away it's all stapled on the edges but in the middle it can still move around so that's as full of stuff it'll, it'll oh go. and there come here comes the sun you want to sing <laughs> okay I'm going in the house bye 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 bye, -bye.
So there you go. <laughs> Told you I'd show you after I was done. I got one little piece here that I'm going to short. But uh, when we do this wall here, I'll have enough extra to go up and do that too. So that might be all I do today with the shoulders. Feeling that. The more brown, the more mild. Brown. 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 I'd say it's this one, eh? Oh, good. I would love another mild one. Oh, he's going to grab Grab him, my boy. Why is he moving? Oh, just, you can pick him up. He won't bite. Don't forget to grab him. Oh, oh, hey! Oh, oh, my God. He's all curled up. Hey, help me. Don't squish him, though. I don't know what they're doing. This a little ball, eh? Yeah, that looks like a ball. Mm -hmm. That's how it looks like. There's going to be. Wow! Oh, this is so cute. Is it a little cough? Yeah, you're just sitting there. Careful, though. Squeeze them too much. Why? Because you'll squish them. Look at you, look at you go. <laughs>